श्री दीप नारायण भगवान की जय देव दिदेव देव शर्मा देव की जय डियर फ्रेंड्स टूडे इज अस्पिशियस डे टूडे इज अ बर्थ एनिवर्सरी ऑफ रिस्पेक्टेड बिलव्ड कपूर चंद कुलिस जी ही इज वेरी फेमस इन इंडिया एज अ फाउंडर क्रिएटर ऑफ राजस्थान पत्रिका one big publishing house it was very small time then but now it's very huge publishing house i think it's first or second in hindi language but i met him first time in 1990 in uh, hungary and we had uh, our gurudev vishwa guru mahamandaleshwar swami maheshwaran puri ji introduced us to his work to rajasthan patrika and uh, to his versatile jeevan life newspaper business is very famous for politics and social duties and so on and but what is different with uh, kapurchan college ji and with uh, his uh, son gulab kotari ji is that they did not only take politics and social life into the account but they also presented the science especially the vedic science of india india is known as a cradle of civilization it's a treasury of so many different different types of knowledge it's uh, like a treasury on ocean of knowledge india is most famous for its vedas the first written document which is collected by kapurchand kulish ji into this book called shabdved shabdved consists of all material of in the vedic sanskrit vedic language and it's published in a beautiful book in very voluminous and of course very heavy presentation of the complete vedic heritage of india now the what is very important these texts are very rare an effort of anybody especially kapurjan kulish ji and his son gulab kotari kotari ji to present and preserve the vedic knowledge and the vedic language should be definitely awarded kapurchan kuli ji and his son gave this book and many other books to many centers swami ji centers vishwaguru ji centers in europe and many universities this book is amazing treasure which kapurchan kuliji left behind him but not only that we just have a few samples of the whole publishing house of uh, rajasthan patrika and mostly we concentrated on spiritual knowledge rajasthan patrika just celebrated gulab kotari's 400 book few years back now he had more books added in his uh, library so can you imagine that this is a newspaper whose main business was actually to sell the news but no kapurchan kuliji and his son gulab kotari decided to go little bit off this normal trend and use this knowledge to start uh to promote the indian tradition so we have the old book and of course we have the new type of the books this is rajrishi vidyayam and brahmanivaran vivart by uh, gulab ji kotari and uh, of course the knowledge which is hidden in vedas and was promoted a lot by kapurchan kulish ji thanks to his son gulab kotari he created a set of books under the name of manas which we then now we can read in english
because for us in Europe, Hindi is not very, uh, we, not the language we can easily read. So today is birth anniversary of uh, Kapuchan Kulishji, and on this occasion, I wanted to thank him and thank to his son that they continued the great tradition of Indian rishis where they uh, promoted the knowledge on a high level. Even today, Gulabji Kotari is publishing in Rajasthan Patrika once a week or every now and then some uh, big, uh, some uh, scientific lectures on Vedic lectures and so on. So this is very important for today's journalism that we don't have only the which politicians is against which politicians, which problems should be solved and so on, but to have something in advance. India was once known as a Vishwaguru, as a teacher or the leader of the whole world. Due to some reason, of course, this stopped being. But this vast heritage of India can make it again happen because we need a new ways how to promote peace, how to promote cooperation with, on the whole level, especially nowadays in this time of Corona, when everything is in the same time blocked and in the same time open, blocked on a physical level, but open on this internet level. As you can see, this Shabdved is a big book and one part of Shabdved is Shatpat Brahman. Shatpat Brahman by itself is approximately that thick, but uh, this is only the original language, Vedic Sanskrit. And now the Rajasthan Patrika published five books like this on the Shatpat Brahman. Shatpat Brahman are like commentaries on one part of the Vedas. So this is like one of the five books there now, maybe two will be more published. So the Kapurchan Kulishji was not only the newspaper man, he was also thinking in advance for the future, for the future generation. And I thank him, I thank to Gulab Kontari that they continued such kind of work that uh, promotes the whole and it benefits the whole world. With these words, I'm really happy that today we had the opportunity to remember Kapur Chankuliji. Of course, these few minutes is not enough to express and explain what he was doing in his life, but just you can always read on internet about his life and so we hope we will have something about him very soon. In the name of Vishwaguru Deep Ashram Research Center, we thank both to Kapurchan Kulishji and his son Gulab Kotari for this vast work based on uh, Pandit Madhusudan Oja and many other great scholars in India because without their promotion, these scholars would basically be lost. Thank you very much. With this word, Sridip Narayan Bhagwan Ki Jai.